Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Taisha. I hope you're all doing well. So for today's video, I am doing a Walmart try on haul. I'm so excited for this video. So I'm going to be sharing with you guys a bunch of pieces I found at my local Walmart and also online. So anything I can find a link for, I'll link it in the description box below. So make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up if you guys love my Walmart hauls. I have done a Walmart try on haul before, so I'll link that below for you guys if you want to see some fall pieces. But I'm definitely doing one this year as well this one is more summer you know very summery but still lounge wear at the same time but yeah guys all that being said i am gonna be sharing with you guys my otd because i love it so let me show you guys what i'm wearing today so this is my otd as you guys can see it's very very casual today so this joggers right here are actually from walmart the men's section i'm gonna show you guys how i diy them and make them into really cute shorts i also did did tuck them in so i'm gonna show you guys the actual length and then i'm showing you right now how i'm wearing them you know for today's outfit i would describe this outfit as a very casual yet still semi-stylish outfit so yeah i'm wearing that and then i'm also wearing it with this top right here this is obviously not real i think i got this from etsy but i don't really remember where i got this from i did get it quite a, quite a while ago and then when it comes to accessories my jewelry for today i'm wearing these earrings they are from amazon and then this necklace is from sheen and this other necklace is from xixi um so yeah guys okay so this is everything i got right here so the first thing we're gonna need are some scissors i got this from walmart i think they were like seven dollars and then i also got the shorts from this brand right here they are 8.96 i was trying to find the regular joggers from this brand or like the hanes brand but you guys there was nothing in stock so i just decided to get this ones they're in a size small and they actually fit me a little bit tight so i would suggest you go a size up if you do have like curves but what i'm gonna do is cut this just a little bit more to give them that appearance that a lot of brands are doing and then i also got this sweatshirt in an extra large this was the only size they had and this is super comfortable super soft i actually want another one just to wear it like on its own and then this is the last thing i got it's a crew next 2xl and yeah i'm gonna go ahead and crop this okay so i'm gonna go ahead and start cutting everything um let me try and open up this first these are the scissors let's see if i can even open this they're kind of hard to open but yeah guys i've seen so many brands do this and they're super expensive they sometimes charge you like 40 something dollars for them so what i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna cut them right above this line I'm gonna do one side at a time because I am super bad when it comes to DIY and anything. Like, I'm just the worst. So, I'm gonna go ahead and cut this. Okay, so I have one side done. And then I'm gonna go ahead and do the other one. And hopefully they look good. Now I'm going to cut the t-shirt, so this one's going to be a little bit harder to cut. I'm just going to go ahead and just, whoop. if you're cutting anything, you want to make sure you cut it longer and then shorter. Because you can never, you know, if it's too short, it's too short, okay? So let me go ahead and do all of this, and then I'll go ahead and show you guys how everything looks like. I told you guys I'm the worst when it comes to DIYing, but this is what it looks like. So you guys can see it's super pretty it reminds me so much of the aritzia shirt i was wearing um so if you guys are a medium large i would recommend you get a 2xl so it fits like really loose and really baggy and oversized but yeah i have to go and fix that i think i'm gonna go buy more so i can keep cropping them um but that is what it looks like from the back um, and by the way, these jeans are from Topshop, and I think this is from Forever 21 or either Fashion Nova. I need to go through my emails and find it for you guys, but yeah, this is this shirt. I really love it, and I just love how oversized this is, and easily a company can charge you like $25, $30 for this, so DIY it. It's cute. I like it. Let's pretend I actually know how to cut a straight line. Um, but this is what this one looks like. This is super cute. Again, I did cut it a little bit shorter on this side than this one. But again, let's pretend 
I know what I'm doing. This is why I stick to makeup and not doing clothes. But this is what this one looks like. This is going to be so cute for the fall time. I am going to try and just fix it just a little bit. But I love how this shirt was only $6 and we just transform it. Um, and then I also love this. It feels really soft and nice quality to be honest. And yeah, so this is what this one looks like. Really, really casual, yet still really cute and like oversized and just trendy. Super affordable outfit minus the jeans, but that's what it looks like from the back. So these are the jogger sweatpants shorts. I have no idea what they're called. I think they're jogger shorts. I think that's what people are calling them. Well, you guys, Aritzia is selling this for really, really expensive. I think they're $42. Also, Pretty Little Thing has them, I think, for $8. Or you can just, you know, cut your own joggers. So this is what this ones look like. I also like how they have a pocket. And then this is with the t-shirt that we did on. And that's what it looks like from the back. As you guys can see, they're still long. So that I feel really comfortable, you know, going and leaving the house like this. Okay, so as you guys saw, that was my DIY project hopefully you guys enjoyed it but i a thousand percent recommend it you go into the men's section and you can find some really cute pieces so i also found this this is not from the men's section but it's from like the more affordable section of walmart um these are just the time and true or no the no boundaries no boundaries t-shirt that's what they're called this is in a small because it's super stretchy so i knew a small would fit perfectly so this color right here i feel like it's super trendy and a color that a lot of brands do you know they're like the more expensive brands so when i saw this i knew it would look really cute with a pair of jeans which is what i exactly paired it with you can of course pair this with some shorts and also some joggers and you can even make this into a little crop top you know like the not crop top so i find this to be super super cute and it's definitely super casual but you can do a lot of things with this i am definitely going to go and pick out more colors because the material is very good and also very stretchy so if you like a more fitted look like i do then size down i also got this other t-shirt or what are this called like cami shirts you know super simple tank tops um spaghetti strap shirts i think that's what they're called so this one right here was only 5.96 by the way this one right here i think it was 2.96 or 3.96 under five for sure um and i paired everything with some sara jeans or top shop jeans i'm sorry those are the jamie jeans i highly recommend you guys go buy the jamie jeans best investment you're gonna make honestly especially if you have curves like i do the jamie jeans are great and if you're a tall girl like i am by the way i forgot to say it i am 5'7 i weigh 155 i have a medium large in tops and then bottoms i am a size 10 to 13 but if you guys are a tall girl like me top shop jeans like have your back because you can actually pick up the length which i honestly struggle a lot with because a bunch of jeans just make me look brinca charco they look bad okay they just look bad on me so these jeans you guys from walmart i didn't try them on today but i did i have mentioned them to you guys so let me go ahead and fix them these are from time and true size 10 are perfect they are stretchy i have washed this like 10 times or probably more and they last a very long time i remember they were only 17 dollars and i'll link them below if i can find them um, but they're from the time and true brand high rise skinny best jeans ever and i actually like how the length is perfect for my longer legs so these jeans i really recommend and they are from walmart just wanted to tell you guys that as well since i'm sharing a lot of fashion things from walmart but yeah guys this top right here i got from walmart as well i love the detailing this will be really good with a cardigan you know for fall even a blazer if you dress like that you know like the uk girls um but yeah i just wore it with some jeans i believe and it looked really cute and simple the only thing i don't like is that it has cups here i don't think you can remove them but i would say to remove oh yeah you can you can remove them so you can remove the cups and I will suggest you do because you can see them through and then just wear a nude bra with it. I always recommend you wear shapewear and a nude bra with everything, honestly, because it will just make everything look very, very good. But yeah, this is again from the No Boundaries line and I really, really like it and I got it in a size medium. Before I forget, 
my bag is over there but you guys will see it throughout this whole video i got that bag you guys from walmart i got it online i'll link it below very nice quality i love the color of it i love 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 that print even though it's not real it's inspired i still really like the aesthetic it gives you so if you do not have i think it's like two thousand dollars for that bag you might have i think it was 34 dollars for it so make sure you guys go and check that bag out i really really like it i believe it's from rose days but like i said i'll link it below and i just love the way it completes every single look um i remember pairing that bag with this dress this dress i got it online as well this is from sinana premium that's what it says right there this is in a size medium but again this is from walmart.com and i believe this was only nine dollars and i got this in the shade blue gray it is so stretchy it fits amazing and i love this pair with that bag that i found at walmart as well you guys would not even believe that's from walmart right everything just looks super pretty really like fancy but like broke bitch style you know um so i really love how this dress fits i love the length i love how casual it is and i also love how you can dress it up with or you can dress it up or dress it down i will personally wear this with a longer cardigan you know to leave the house to still look really classy but get still cute and of course i'm wearing this with my waist trainer like always i just love wearing anything that snatches me up so my body can you know mold into that shape all right so the next thing i got you guys online are this couple of things from the queen the colombiana queen colombian queen sofia vergara so she has a line at walmart i actually didn't know um until my mom sent me like her email because she's like signed up into the walmart emails and she got a notification that they released new, new things so i decided to give them a try these are the sofia jeans by sofia vergara everything i got in a size medium when it comes to tops and the jeans i got them in a size 10 let me tell you something right now if you are tall these jeans are not good for us uh, at least the ones I picked up. I don't remember the exact name. They just say Sophia Skinny Ankle. It could be that, like, the reason why they're not tall girl friendly. But yeah, girl, this just looks like Brincachar con me. It just doesn't look good. Too short, and I don't like it. But I love the wash of these jeans. The quality is very nice and stretchy. But I did have a problem with my waist. The jeans were a lot, lot bigger around my waist. Which on the other regular Walmart line, that doesn't happen. So I need to try out more of her jeans, I'm guessing. Let me know if you guys like them. But for me, they were a no. Or at least this one was a no. Um, oh yeah, they're called a mid rise skinny ankle but on hers it looks longer and on me it was like up to here so it could be my length and it could also be this one that i picked up um but the bodysuit though i do really like the bodysuits i actually got two bodysuits so the first one right here is the gray one this i got in a size medium it's called the scoop neck bodysuit very nice quality but girl let me tell you something this was $16.50 so I thought God, oh, it, it's expensive you know for being Walmart but the quality is there and of course since it's her line I feel like she knows what she's putting because the quality feels really nice and stretchy like I said Walmart's clothing is super stretchy and I also really like here that you can like open and close up your bodysuit I love the color I know there's a beige color black and then gray and of course I got the gray because I'm super basic but this is stuff I like to wear a lot Especially during all times of the year, you can always accessorize this, make it more casual with a cardigan, boots, you know, jeans, classic fall look. But yeah, super stretchy, good material. This I would actually recommend you try. And then the next bodysuit I got is the mock turtleneck bodysuit this was $20 you see a little bit more expensive but definitely the quality it's up there like it's nice quality this is stuff that you would actually wear because it's a bunch of basics so this I paired it with a skirt from Walmart that I got last year for fall this is the no boundaries high rise skirt in a size 9 I don't know if they still have it in stock or maybe they'll bring it again but that's what I paired it with and I think it looks really cute really sophisticated if I were to go out on this i would probably wear it with some ankle booties for the fall i feel like it will be super cute um that gray bodysuit i also styled it with these shorts right here i thought they were gonna be too short on me but they actually look really good and decent these are the no boundaries high rise mom fit jeans 
this was only 11.88 really really nice quality definitely thick like this is not stretchy at all so you might want to size up a size 11 fit me great for my size 13 to 10 you know depending on the brand so that's my reference for you guys but i just love the wash the way it fit it wasn't too short you know you know how i feel about super short shorts this just looked really good on my body and i really liked it um so this is kind of a, a hidden gem at walmart the shorts are actually really pretty and they pair with a lot of things you can also pair with that bag that i told you guys about um and it's just cute and stylish and then the next thing i got is this top right here this is once again from the no boundaries line i feel like no boundaries is more like teenage you know junior clothing and then time and truth a little bit more professional you know um but this line or this shirt i got it in a size extra small because it was the only one left in the store and surprisingly it actually fit so walmart is making me feel skinny this is the first extra small shirt i own so this was 10.96 i love the print super cute this darker color is perfect to to transition from summer to fall uh because the color is not too bright it's just like such a pretty color you can wear it off the shoulder you know normal depends up to you but super super stretchy and again the back look at that it has such stretchy material if it didn't have that i could not fit into it and this top i think i show you guys this when i was doing my shop with me video this is the no boundaries top in a size large which is a size 11 to 13 super super stretchy i got a large because they were out of stock of all my sizes and i really like this top it's cute it's pretty um i always thought this peplum thing style made me look a little bit like wider but it actually looks really cute you know i cannot always be wearing crop tops so this is the top i will wear when i'm going out with my mom you know and i need to be a little bit more covering up that stomach this is something i would wear but yeah guys that is it that is all i have for today's video let me know what you guys think what was your favorite items that i styled today for today's video i will really recommend you guys go and check out walmart if you are on a budget and you want some cute clothing you can pretty much make everything work as i show you guys i love the diy projects i did even though everything came out crooked it still looks cute okay nobody needs to know that i just cannot cut a straight line um, but thank you so much for watching you guys and hanging out with me please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it let me know in the comments below your opinions things you're gonna buy or just anything just comment below i love reading and talking to you guys but yeah have a beautiful blessed day and i'll see you guys on the next one bye guys